Welcome back to Competitive Street, I'm Nick. And I'm John. And we're here playing Pyre for Blind Indie Gaming, and we're about to start our journey to flagging cats. To the flogging logs. Oh, that, that sounds brutal. <laughs> Come down, you find Hedwin and Jadari all assessing the current situation with the mental body. Are you most certain? Well, Aye, madam. I make no claim to the journey. The journey shall be pleasant, but it is necessary. Edwin motions to you as they continue talking. Here oh, the hurry, they're distracted. Come on, let's go behind the wagon. <laughs> oh, no, no, no! <laughs> Seems we'll have some work to do once we arrive in flagging hands. Oh, let's get going. As soon as you're ready. Or let's get going as soon as you're ready. No, that's weird. Sooner we get there, sooner we can leave. Flagging hands. We're going to jump over uh, Bob Marley's skeleton. <laughs> How are we going to get there? Oh, just the, whoa! Look at the hops on that thing! <laughs> Man! That thing went high! Oh, Crazy. fart clouds. Hooray! <laughs> That's where I always wanted to visit. That's my favorite thing about everything. Yeah. When just farts are emanating from the ground. Mm -hmm. I will consider. I'll proceed. The flagging hands region proves as, as dismal as Jadario indicated. The air is thick and foul. <laughs> How far to the pit of my life? Belief? Milithae. Like Milithae. One of those three. Okay, so it's going to the right there. All the way across the marshlands on the coast. Rivaros. But either. But you join me in the wagon for a moment. We have matters to discuss. Who wants to see me in the wagon? <laughs> Jadariel and Hedwin exchange looks. Then she turns to you. Go, go see what he wants. I, I must discuss the single pant problem with him. Yes. Thank you for, for your time, Rita. I have something for you. On behalf of my client, before you is an artifact called the Beyond Air Crystal. You observe a shimmering crystal of some sort beside the book writes. As you have surmised, the triumvirates you are to confront with your eyes shall stop at nothing to prevent, to, to prevail against you. They have prepared for this for quite some time. The Beyond Air Crystal may help ensure that you are well prepared. Pre 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 Wow. <laughs> it Perfect. is a resource now at your disposal, to be used at your discretion. Gaze upon it, and you shall see what I mean. But first, bang, 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 uh, bang, bang. Take, take this mushroom. <laughs> okay, see, I, I show you the magic of single pant. You don't <laughs> understand the freedom you have been missing. <laughs> you look upon the shimmering surface of the Beyonder Crystal. Some Beyond of crystal. your senses fail, though you retain a hold over your consciousness. An apparition appears before you, clad in the ramus of the rites, but incorporeal. Unfortunately, the sense that did not fail is your smell. Ugh. I sense that you are not a total idiot. She reaches for the clasps on her mask. You can tell that it's a curl. So, the Nightwings have returned. Oh, but where are my manners? You must be their lovely reader. Please, call me Sandra. Sandra. We met briefly before when you first beheld the book, when you were stuck inside of it. I was among the phantoms your companions banished there, no doubt stroking their egos, especially that headwind person. Something tells me he enjoys stroking. <laughs> you listened well enough to that damned voice. Now I suggest you listen well to me, the voice. I am bound in servitude to you, along with any idiots whose freedoms happen to be intertwined with yours. Oh, good. I know the rights better than anyone. I can soon whip you into shape, but if you take advantage of my services. I like whipping. Isn't it fun? Cool whip. <laughs> First, I offer scribe trials to those friends of yours. If they can pass, it shall, soon, it shall be worth their while, and yours, with the whipping. Secondly, my Beyonders and I avail ourselves for practice rights, should you be so inclined, with whipping. Or, you could always come and chat, and briefly free me from an eternity of boredom. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm going to... Want to do the trials? Yes, do trials. Let's, Let's do trials! trials. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Indeed, yeah. it is as though one of those failures of yours is ready for a lesson in pain. Oh, who shall? I mean, I could just leave you in that orb. Who's the failure? Yeah. Okay. Who should we put in there? Yes. 
Ineligible. Ineligible? No. I guess it's only Rookie. Why only Rookie? Oh, is it because he's the only one with the green experience? No. no. Right. Well, I guess you can only choose Rookie. Let's do it. It is secret. You ask Sandra time. to administer one of her special trials for Rookie. I mean, what the loudmouth purr? Well, I suppose that he is ready, technically, though I have a litany of reservations about him. But let us bring him forth. Do you think she's throwing a fart in that robe? Uh, maybe. Leaking out? Yeah, I think so. It's like airtight all the way up to her neck. <laughs> <laughs> Soon Ruki appears in heat of the summons. Uh, Chum, why are you looking at me like that? What's going on? Put down the knife! Ah! Oh. <laughs> oh, Rookie, you have no idea what's coming to you. It's gonna be so bad. Oh, what are we doing? It's a one on one. Oh, it is. Alright, what's the big idea, huh? This is some sort of trick you're playing, chum? The apparition Sandra then appears and unfastens her mask. Sandra. Shut your snout and listen well, Kerr. <laughs> you answer to me, uh -huh. dear. Uh, what? Your mouth runs quicker than those stubby little paws. Hey, that's not... Okay, maybe that's true. <laughs> you have much to learn if you have any intent to prevail in the rites. Let us see how you fare without the benefit of your trusted comrades. Save for your lovely reader. Uh, I, I guess it's me and you then, huh, chum? Wherever you are. Oh, I'm in, huh? What? Huh? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, no! Um, um, banish, banish, run, run! Oh, no, 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 no! Boom. Okay. We gotta, we're gonna have to do secret puppet formation. You ready for the secret puppet formation? Yes, go. Okay. Uh, secret puppet formation! Done. Good job. Oh my goodness. Wait, am I, oh, I was gonna say, if I didn't come back. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. You're gonna have to do the, the, the run and jump, probably. Oh, that's. Oh, man. This is not what you gotta do. Okay. Uh, oh! Oh, I ran out of enough. stamina. No! Okay. No! Oh! 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 Okay. Okay. Pupper attack! Pupper attack! Oh, boy. Oh boy. There it is. Oh man. Wow. That was good. Woo. This is like really got stressful. got two more. Uh, no. Oh, ow, ow. No, no. No, it's pulling me back. Pulling me back. Oh. Oh, oh man. Man. You can't suffer too many of those. No, I won't. I'm not making it. Okay. All right, so now you're dead. They're down. They're down one permanent. Oh yeah, you're right. They are. Bumper attack. <laughs> Nice. One more. We need one more. Okay. Oh, one over. Oh, he's back. He's back. What do I do? What do I do? Oh, it's so scary. It's so scary. Uh. I'm just gonna leave one on there. Um, that's messed up. Secret Papa attack. Nice. Oh, he looks kind of like a dragon. With that yeah. Idea. I'm so, He's secretly a lizard. Probably. Success! Hooray! Hey, that is how we do it, right, chum? This is how we do it. It is, and you acknowledge likewise that you did not do it on your own, despite having to face my demon friends all by yourself. That's right, they were demons. Isn't that cool? You passed my test, sir. Congratulations are in order, both to you and to your lovely reader. Now, farewell. Come you back for a die. whipping anytime. <laughs> <laughs> we have scheduled whippings on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday <laughs> after 9 a.m. I'm usually booked up pretty tight, but I, I think I can work you in. Oh, you, you seem like the type that would enjoy my services. So, <laughs> we did it. What do we get? That Sandra kind of gives me the shakes. You know what I mean, chum? Uh, dude, did you poop on the floor again? Yeah. What are you trying to tell me? <laughs> hey, what's that you got? You receive Jumur's Fang for completing Rookie's trial. I will totally accept the reward. Can you not accept it? Uh, you know, actually, <laughs> yeah, I'll probably just sit there forever. Uh, all right, so let's give him a, a thing. In the common room, you have a view. That's what I thought. 
so. What? Where's the thing I can do? What is? What does it do? Um, can he only? Can oh, only it must Rookie? be. Only is by Rookie. Probably. Yeah. Level five blood. Lingers longer than usual. Oh. That's pretty cool. Dude, that is awesome. We're totally using him next time. After being banished, so who should we give that to? Chance to return immediately. Oh, probably. Uh, Infy, right? Yeah. There That's you what go. I was he doesn't have anything yet. All right. Oh. There we go. There it is. Um, <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry. Can I do another trial? Not had enough of me just yet. Is that it? Yes, definitely. Oh man. Oh, okay. I'm not doing it. Right. Sorry. That's, that's the thing. Yeah. I ain't wasting my time. Go forth and show your, your adversaries what you have learned. Um, I learned how to clean up poop. This rookie <laughs> just keeps doing it. I have learned how to best weather a whipping. <laughs> you find everyone is feeling rather miserable. You sense just being in flogging logs eats away in everyone's spirit. Only the imp Tizo seems unaffected. Tizo! Most of your fellow exiles lost minus one hope in the next grade. Well, oh, okay. we're gonna go solo Tizo this time, then. A moment, reader. There are several courses we may take through flogging hands. If you choose to prolong your stay, it may be worth your while. However, your companion's spirits shall likely suffer more. As you can see, okay. I have no soul. Oh, there's Perfect three thing. places we can go. We can go to oh. Fallow Field. Uh, can prove a talisman if you take a job here. Okay. okay. Uh, faster route will reduce your hope loss. Okay. So get a valuable item. Which one should we do? Get the valuable item. Okay. To the cold moat. <laughs> yeah. We made it. Oh. Northern route through flagging hands is a dismal, is dismal beyond reckoning. There is little talk among your group, yet you sense despair approaching. Only Tizo seems unaffected. Tizo. Minus one hope. Yep. Whatever. What does hope do? Uh, it's. I think it's the amount of time you spend banished. Oh. Later, you accompany the lone mistral in pursuit of his task here. Speak not directly to the living shade, and be true to your heart in responding to its inquiries. And make no attempt to look in the eye. It's really uh, and also, don't put your hands in your pockets. They, they take that as a sign of offense. <laughs> the lone minstrel offers these and other words and advice as you approach the burial mounds in cold mode. For many exiles of the downside see their final days. Welcome okay. The north route. Thank you for that valuable information. A glimmer of shade appears before you as you stand surrounded by the dead. You barely see it, and it does not speak, but you feel its thoughts piercing your heart and mind. Ah! According to the shade, the book that you possess may lay some of the fallen here to rest. Okay. The shade leaves you to your work. You turn through the book, locating passages concerning freedom and the spirit. You recite such words as best seem fit to each of the fallen here. It is draining work. The shade resurfaces after a while. It leads you to the hollowed stump and then fades away. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> you found a knock shroom. You quickly put it away. We should have upgraded the knock. What does that do? The knock shroom gets you. <laughs> knock shroom lets you see things that you wouldn't normally have seen. By the time you reach the pit of belief, everyone, besides the Imptizo, seems to be feeling even worse than before. You sense their desire to leave this place as soon as possible. Lose more hope. Oh, God. Prepare for the right anyway. What? Like, like I had an option. Are you kidding me? Oh, Slug Mart. Not the Slug Mart. All right, we have a quick conversation. <laughs> I think we're going to wrap it up. What you got? You sensed Jadara's steel gaze well before you turned her. Because she's looking at you, you can feel her horns poking your side. Ow. Reader, rummaging about the wagon once again. What? All you do is rummage, you stupid little... Rummage. Tell me something, now that you are here. Look at me. Are you afraid of me? Yes. Like, no, I'm relentlessly attracted to you. Is, there, is that an option? <laughs> you consider the question. You have never before met someone like her, but... Do know something of what happens to those who remain on the downside for many years. I'm afraid of my attraction. What, what for happens? You. Yeah. Um. Uh. Uh. 
What can I do? I say deny it. Deny. You tell her that although you do not yet know each other well, you do not fear her, and on the contrary, feel safer in her presence. Dashi. Truly, safe from my attraction. In that case, I have much work left to do, and you shall fear me yet, if you survive this place. Now then, I shall go make my rounds. Wait, that wasn't the right answer? She walks away. You feel the floor of the wagon shake with, with her step. Oh, I guess we pissed her off. Hey! <laughs> awesome! So, uh, that was fun. Uh, we had a, I guess, a, a bit of a subtle conversation with Jodario. Yeah. Um... So let's uh, commence the right next time on competitive shake. I guess so. Or we could go to the slug mart. Oh my god. Like, I love slug mart. And keep the slug alive. I don't know. Jelly bean sausages.